Hello, is this thing on? Hello? It's hot as balls outside. Anyways, besides the point, hello! Welcome to my video. This is my room tour. I'm going to be showing you guys around the room that I live in. I didn't really prepare for this. This was spontaneous. I literally just did my hair and my makeup for the day and I was like, you know what? I got time to do something. I haven't done anything in a while and I'm just feeling, feeling a little motivated right now and I have time so let's just do it! I didn't clean or anything. This is just how my room looks most of the time. It does get messy, but right now it's looking good because this is how I like to keep it. You'll see. Generally clean. And anyways, yeah. So we'll go through the thing. Um, we'll start at the door. So when you walk in my room, this is my room. Hello. You have this A that my friend made me in college. I used to be obsessed with uh, mustaches, and I think that she just thought this color was pretty. I don't know, but she, it was so nice. It was just like a random like birthday kind of gift. And then at the entrance, I also have my Crocs. These are my outdoor Crocs, because I think that everyone should have indoor and outdoor Crocs. And these I just slip on. I need to go outside, slip them on. I like to be barefoot in my house, because um, we have nice clean wooden floors most of the time. Here is the bed. It's a pretty tiny room. The camera is not deceiving you. I literally only have space for this bed and like four other pieces of furniture, which is like a lot. And then I have like this little, this little pathway to walk on, which is my thicker pathway. And then this little area where I have my closet. It has a little like, what is this called? The backrest thing I got in college. Probably get a new one. I also have a body pillow because I like to cuddle with pillows when I'm sleeping. Although lately I've been cuddling with like, so I have, I have six pillows on my bed, like six normal pillows. And I use, I use four of them for sleeping and two of them are decorative because they're not fluffy anymore and I don't want to use them. I like my pillows fluffy and I like to sink in them. You know, so that's why I use two because most of the time it works out. I like I like to sleep with a lot of pillows. It's my thing. I love pillows. Also, my bed has storage underneath, but uh, we won't look inside those because those are a fucking mess. But it's two drawers. This is my rave drawer with all my rave stuff in it, and then that one is like miscellaneous things that I don't use that often, but I use sometimes. So I need them at hand, kind of thing. Yeah. So on the right. Well, let's go behind the door. Behind the door, we have all my bags. This is where I keep my backpacks and my bags and my scarves, my limited scarves. Literally have like two. And then I have this, it's a, what's it called? Oh, my umbrella is up there too. Cape. I have a cape. I have a Superman cape because I love Superman. And here we have my dresser, which is one of my favorite parts of my room. When it's tidy, it's so nice. Look at all this room for activity. So I don't have a desk in my room. I do have this computer on a shelf. I used to have a desk connected to this shelf that would like come out a little bit, but I wanted like more room. And I also never use this computer for like actual like computer things. It's really mostly like a TV because I just play like Netflix on it whenever I want to. This is what I probably would use more as a desk. I have here, oh my god, I'm, oh, please ignore my plant. Her name was Sally. She died, but I think she's still really pretty even though she's dead. And she's hanging out in my Michael Triceratops. <laughs> That's what I named him. I painted this guy and I cut a hole in him to make him a planter. And my plants never live that long. I am horrible. Plus this place isn't really good for succulents. They barely get light from there. Yeah, I tend to overwater my succulents because I just, I don't know. I worry about them. I love them too much. I don't know what's wrong. But my flowers always a blooming. I do pretty good with flowers, not gonna lie. My flowers just bloomed. This one just bloomed today and this one bloomed yesterday and then the rest of them obviously like they've been bloomed but I love having natural things, nature. I love nature and I like having like plants and stuff in my room. I don't know it just makes me feel alive and I love it and it's so nice. So yeah I like to keep some stuff around here. Um, I also have a candle. This one's honeysuckle. It's my favorite summertime scent and then in here I keep my little jewelry so I have my earrings my ring and um, this bracelet with like all these like saints on it I don't know it's as religious as I get honestly I don't really I'm not very religious more spiritual or whatever you know how people say that um, but I am I am spiritual here I just have like pens and pencils and uh, my scissors because I always need those on hand um, and at the bottom there's some chalk for my chalkboard that's over there but we'll get to that later here we have 
this cork board that I made that's like in a frame. It's a really pretty frame. I spray painted this too. I love silver. I don't know if you can tell. And I have my necklaces on it. Some pictures from my childhood. Look at that little bitch. Woo. My virgin. Again, spiritual, not religious, but I love the Virgin Mary. I, I don't know. Something about being Mexican is just in my, you know. Oh, fuck. Can you guys shut up, please? Okay, cool. Shut off my phone. So, all my necklaces, they're pretty cool. I don't really wear the necklaces that much. I have two little spots right here. One, two. Because um, I had these two necklaces that had crystals on them, and I used to wear those every day. And I wear my dinosaur pretty often, my little dinosaur. Look at them. But not as often as I wear my crystals. It was a uh, amethyst and a rose quartz, and I would wear them every day. But um, the chains broke, and I need to get new chains, and I haven't done that. Anyways, up here we have my little wall of headbands that I didn't start collecting until I was 15 and I also have like other ears and stuff over here we'll get back to that later so I had like I would buy like ears and stuff every time I would go to Disneyland but my mom was not a proponent of spending money on that type of thing but then once I became an adult I could spend my money on whatever I wanted so I bought more ears I didn't actually get a pair of like the original ones like these those I didn't get those till last year actually and I've gone to Disneyland well over 35 times in my life may not seem like that much but I live in NorCal so it's not like I can go every weekend so it's a lot it's a lot to have gone to Disneyland 35 times not living near it ever but I love Disney so Anyways, continuing on with the tour, um, you move on from this little section. These are just my drawers. Over here I have some paint that I gotta deal with. Moving on, here's my mirror. Look, that's me. I'm wearing a Rick and Morty shirt. Uh, just got it yesterday and I'm kind of obsessed with it. I just love the tie-dye look of it. You know, I don't wanna see it better. Look at it. Pew. And I'm just wearing biker shorts because I'm lazy. This is my closet. There's stuff in here, but we don't have to see that. It's kind of a also kind of a mess but I really like this mirror because it like opens up the whole room it's a tiny tiny room to be honest um up here we have my clock tells the time pretty great here I have my know your beer poster and my laundry basket it's pretty cool pretty cool I have this helmet that ooh, there we go I have this helmet that belonged to my brother he used to ride motorcycles so I kept his helmet. Here we have something that my fraternity gave me. It is the Friendship Award. My fraternity is based off of leadership, friendship, and service. So at the end of our pledging semester, they gave us awards for like different things in leadership, friendship, service, and then like a couple others. And I got the Friendship Award because apparently I'm friendly or something. I don't know. Then continuing on, we have this. Oh shit. <sighs> This picture of me and my friend Kate, she gave it to me for my birthday like two years, three, no, longer, like four years ago. Yeah, and I miss her. She lives in Santa Barbara. I don't get to see her that often, so she gets to live on my wall. And then moving on, I have my hat displayed because my thing, I think, you know how like everyone has like a collecting thing? I feel like I have my little... Minnie Mouse hat, and then a Mickey Mouse hat, and then a Disneyland hat. And then I have this hat from CorgiCon. This one's um, Bob's Burgers. It has Tina. It says Butts. This little one right here has a little flamingo. And then the rest of them all come from, like, different um, events and places that I've been to. So my thing, I'm going to try. I've been, I've been pretty good at it. But most trips that I take, I will buy a hat so that I can not remember the trip because obviously I'll remember the trip forever but my souvenir is a hat because I like dad hats I I don't wear them that often but I do pretty often enough that I like them and I want to have more because you know everyone does shot glasses and there's nothing wrong with that um I would love to have shot glasses but my pantry is not mine so I don't have the room for them in this tiny tiny room and then here I have an imagine poster um you know the Beatles it's the thing that they have in New York though. I've never been to this exact location but I want to go and my, me and my dad were obsessed with the Beatles when I was growing up. I still love the Beatles and every time I listen to the Beatles I get really like emotional and excited. Anyway here I have my calendar. It's pretty blank right now but it's August. Look at it. In this little corner we have my salt lamp that I don't use as often anymore because I'm not home like in the evening times. I used to turn it on at night when I was having, like if I would meditate at night or something, I would turn it on. Now I meditate in the morning and I come back home pretty late so I just go to bed. I don't really leave it on. Cause I also don't like sleeping with it on. I used to sleep with it on and I found that it kind of made me a little at rest 
properly, so I don't sleep with it on anymore. But it's still cool. I really like what it brings to the space, you know, the energy or whatever. Here we have my essential oil diffuser. I have it facing this way so it doesn't like wet stuff here. Because this is where I usually keep my phone at night or um, my hair tie and stuff like that. Down underneath it, this little box has my essential oils and some melatonin pills that I take sometimes and then up here we have some books that I like to read when I go to sleep a flashlight because um, we are prepared in this house and <laughs> if there's ever like a power outage or I mean we get those sometimes a power outage or like you know in an emergency you need a light I got a light just in case Moving on, we have this little area. This is a pig that I got for my birthday one year. This Jigglypuff, I won him at a car- her, him, I don't know, Pokemon. Um, but my boyfriend's really into it and I won that at a carnival. These boxes are like memory boxes, like they have just a bunch of stuff. I think this one has school supplies, don't remember. Oh, this one has like a bunch of little trinkets that used to be like all, all up down um my drawer, my bookshelf, whatever this is called. But I- didn't really have a place for them anymore. This is kind of like a pretty packed bookshelf and I liked, I wanted to have like a clear kind of shelf so I just put stuff in that box that I don't, I don't want to get rid of them. I don't know. Yeah, I have things that I don't really want to get rid of but I don't know what to do with them so I'm waiting for, you know, when I move out, I can use them then. That's the thing. And I just have books. These are my yearbooks from like high school. I have some childhood books. Um, and then down here, we got Harry Potter, more childhood books, and then some like self-help kind of stuff. This little thing is from, I've had it, I don't even remember when I got it. I think I've had it like my whole life. That's why it's like, the water's like yellow, because it, it's like one of those things that you like shake it and it, um, you shake it and it sparkles or whatever, you know, the glitter stuff inside. We also have this little girl. She used to put me to sleep when you turn her. Um, she like plays little music and it used to put me to sleep. Who knew I needed like noise to go to sleep ever since I was little. That's crazy. I mean, I knew that, but I don't know. I never like put things together and now like I need sound. Like I have a fan or I have like ASMR playing or I have a meditation playing. Like I need some noise while I'm going to sleep. Um, here's my little piggy bank. I actually use it for coins. Here's, oh, this is messy. This is supposed to be closed, but, um, it has, like, my games in it. Like, I have my DS and my Game Boy. I love this Game Boy. My boyfriend got it for me, and I'm fucking obsessed, because it's just it's so nostalgic, and I love, I loved the Game Boy that I, I used to have one of those when I was little, and I loved, I loved it. And he got me one that looks exactly the same. And then obviously, like, this is just a, what is that called? <laughs> Lint roller. <laughs> and here I have deodorant, perfumes, and, like, uh, smell stuff, and sunblock. Yeah, sunblock. And then up here is, I just don't, I collect, like, my rent money in here, and then, like, savings in the other one. Just, like, a bunch of random stuff in this one, actually. I don't even... Not too sure. Oh, my passport. Okay, well, that's kind of important. I should probably put that somewhere safe. Well, it's kind of safe here. I don't know. I didn't even know it was there. Anyways, there are, like, extra pencils and stuff. Although, I feel like I could put these in the school supplies box. But I just, I don't know. I haven't. This is for my whiteboard. And then here are some cleaning supplies that I like to have on hand. Because I don't know where else to put them. And I like to have my room clean. Like, I wiped down all the surfaces. So, I need those. Um, my Gudetama. I love this. I just love eggs and I love my Gudetama, so yeah. Here we have, this is like a nice little perfume bottle that I have like displayed. It's from Betsy Johnson, I think. Um, my mom loves to give me a perfume every year for like Christmas or my birthday, so that's kind of like a tradition. That's why I have like all these perfumes too. It's like, my like, little flower thing. Yeah. Um, here I have a Triceratops that I built. Well, I didn't build the Triceratops. But I built like this little tree that keeps falling over and this little rock and these little things and this log. Um, and then he lives in it. Isn't that so cute? I don't know if you could tell. I really like Triceratops. I have a tattoo of it too. Like he's so cute. And up here we have these things. This is like two watches that I like never use. I think this one isn't even like on. I have to like solar, solar power it. These are some rings I think that I don't use either. Oh, it's like, oh, okay. All of this is my jewelry that I never use, but it's stuff that I like enough to keep. So like if I have a special event or something, I can like wear that. And then this is a T-Rex, I think. We found him in a Walmart in Washington. It's like a puppet. <laughs> we went to Paradiso at the Gorge in Washington State. 
um, near Seattle and oh no no we found him in Oregon in Portland Oregon when we went to Walmart so we arrived in Portland and then drove to Paradiso and then drove to Seattle after um, it was a whole week trip but we found him in the Walmart and it like didn't have a price or anything so we just kind of like put it in the bag and no one said anything when we checked out like they saw it and they just like put it in the bag and so we kept it i washed it <laughs> i washed it don't worry um but like we took him to the paradiso and everything and he was like playing with him and it's it's really cute and so he's still with us well he's still with me i don't even know if the guys know that i took it but i took it because it was cute and as a memory and it fit so why wouldn't i take him it's part of the family now. It's part of the Ray fam. Moving on. Down here. Okay, this is a whole little shelf experience here. Down here we have my longboard with the mustache. I don't know if you can tell. I like mustaches, so I have them. And then this thing is like a little like desk for your, like a lap desk. That's what it is. So you put it on your lap, whatever. This is a paddle that I have to finish for my big, from my fraternity, Alpha Phi Omega. That's what we are. I have a lava lamp that I used to have on my nightstand. I don't know what I'm going to do with it now, actually. I like it. I like having it, but I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. In here, we have just some old stuff like, oh, that was a build up. <laughs> I have some books and um this is like a drawing book i have my journal in here my ipad and then a harry potter book i like i i used to use the, this stuff a lot and i probably will continue to use it a lot but i just haven't like gone around to organizing it yet my suitcase this is my first like well not my first but one of my first big girl purchases i love this suitcase it's so small it's the smallest measurement to like make sure that it fits through like tsa or like all that all the air all the airplanes um will accept it i think it's 22 inches and the the average is like 24 to 22 inches but sometimes i'll let like 26 and like oh, like over pass but then there's some that are like super strict and they're like no 22 inches you can't go past that and so i was like i don't want to like deal with having to check it so i just got it and it's so cute his name is marshall and then i bought him with a bag that i have stored somewhere else um for traveling too and her name is lily so it's like marshall and lily from you know that one show this is just an amazon package that i got trash these are some books for school that um i was going to return but i may still need them so i'm gonna keep them there and then up here we have my desk that's not a desk my computer that i use for netflix and nothing else this is oh yeah this is my chalkboard i wrote i'm doing my best because i've been going through a little bit of a rough patch and this has actually really helped me kind of lift myself up when i'm feeling like i'm shit so you know good stuff love that here's a picture of me when i was little look at that it's like the nicest quality like it's in a like it's a, like a wooden block i got it in or someone bought it in mexico got it made and um gave it to me so oh my family's from mexico that's why i got it anyway <laughs> this is my tiny house um it's not really a house i've only made three pieces of furniture i'm making one piece of furniture every day i just got it like last week if that so i started it three days ago well four days ago i need to make one today and then all the stuff is in here and i just like having it out so i can like remember to see it and also like it's still pretty like neat there you know but yeah it's a fucking it's a lot it's a mess up here we have more like these are like my oh, it's peter and pocahontas peter pan and pocahontas are my favorite disney movies of all time don't come for me i love all disney movies but these are just my favorite and then these are like stuffed animals this one has like a bunch of stuff and then i just like plopped the little pig up there i also love pigs pigs are my favorite animal i would say um i have a lot of pink and pigs everywhere so you know pig 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 yeah so i just i really love pigs and i just like stuffed him in there and he put his little eyes poking out so i thought it was cute this is my dundee look at it ah! oh, my boyfriend got that for me for my birthday and we were we've we were we've been dating for a year now and when he got this for me we were only dating for like four months not even we were only official for like two months and he got that for me and honestly it's one of my like favorite things Ugh, i love him so much he gets me and he gets my office obsession i love it <laughs> then we have these boxes they have like things that i use like um extra chapstick and hand sanitizers and stuff and then i also have like a few purses in there and then in this one i have the rest of my ears that aren't headbands they're like the little caps that you put on and i think i have a sorcerer mickey hat in there too this is like my filing 
cabinet that's like a, as big as my important papers go and then also over here some more important papers like taxes and um, my pay, pay stubs these are some pictures this is my first dog his name was Chiquilin but he died really quick because he got run over um this is me and my dad when I was a baby and then this is my family the four of us at Christmas I think at our godparents house. and my fan that usually lives in this little area but I pull it out to like use it obviously that's it that's my entire room that was my room tour guys I didn't know I had things to show um, but I hope you guys liked it I had fun making it I honestly feel kind of productive right now that I even stopped to film this pretty quick video yeah and hopefully more to come I'm very excited to do more stuff like this in this good lighting hope you guys are having a fantastic day time year month whatever life I hope it's going good and see you guys in the next one. Oh, and thanks for watching Okay, bye.